ஆளுமை மிக்க அரசியல்வாதியாக பியார் பாலிடிக்ஸ் பயிற்சி பட்டறை நேரடி இணைய வழி வகுப்புகள் உங்கள் சீட்டிற்கு முந்துங்கள் See, this is, a, this is an initial seed fund that we are trying to push in. And um, of course, as I said during my speech, also we are going to be uh, going to the Maiti um, and asking for uh, additional funds uh, for the FAB itself. And yes, we are taking inputs from uh, IIT Madras and uh, industry experts to get the best FAB, the best training FAB possible, to make sure that this talent is trained at the best uh, FAB possible. So you do know that Tamil Nadu was supposed to get uh, at least two FABs. Um, but for several reasons it went to some uh, uh, other states we don't have a problem but um, i do think i very, very strongly think uh, for india's uh, um, safety also in, in, in a in a point of safety also you must have uh, one large fab in, in the south of india also i think it makes more um, uh, sense when you given the given the present geo geopolitical situation so um, i do think uh, very soon tamil nadu will get its um, um, due share of fabs and uh, osats and that's coming very very soon we are also working and in talks with many giants globally um, we did have a round of good talks in in singapore during the semicon also so given that manufacturing is inevitably going to come in the future tamil nadu government is not only preparing to enable talent required for that manufacturing but we are also here to say that hey india we we are here i mean you i know that wherever these fabs go wherever these osats go they need high end talent that high end talent is only av- available in tamil nadu in a large volume right so that is why we are here to help india and uh, the world uh, get the best of uh, semiconductor manufacturing talent in that we as you said yes we are supplying this is not this is just a start the semiconductor mission has about 500 crores uh, allocated so it, and we are definitely ready to pump in more money into the sector um, here you look, if you look at it we are enabling an ecosystem right and once you get the talent ready and of course the investors are also going to come closer to the talent and more than that i we we would personally want to have a r&d ecosystem enabled I have been repeatedly saying this Tamil Nadu has to has to become product nation Tamil Nadu right product nation TN that is our ultimate goal we we are the super kings when it comes to manufacturing we are the best in any sector what next i think it's about time that we created products for india make in tamil nadu made in tamil nadu for india and the world and this is one step towards that and semiconductors are inevitable uh, in today's world and i think tamil nadu should lead and we are probably probably the best state best place state to play this game of course i mean mc we have to we we are regularly being very closely working with the union government and maiti has been uh, helping us in a lot of uh, other uh, special clusters also um, so we will we'll put forth our case and i think when you have a uh, friends like uh, uh, kamgodi sir i think they'll definitely work uh, to the best interest of the state um and because with with the talent pool that iit madras brings in and with the professional uh, governance that tamil nadu government brings in this becomes a unbeatable team so what's the timeline you're expecting to complete this yesterday yesterday so yeah uh, we are very good at design we have we have very very strong design house as a country and within iit madras we have actually proven multiple chips that have been fabricated within india also as a country we have a 180 nanometer fab which is at scl those at facilities we have many now it's coming up and we will get many more but the major issue here specifically that we are targeting If you say if this is a marriage then the bride and bridegroom of this marriage is the human capital right we need people who understand fab understand the entire process end to end and fine tune it make the equipment work make the fab running the fab cannot switch off for a single day as you know so it's a 24 cross 7 literally 24 cross 
So this is the quality manpower that we want to develop through this effort. And as uh, you know, um, we want it to be frugal because people have to start learning from resource constraints. Then only they'll be optimal, right? And fabs do work on a very thin margin. Okay, so the chips have to be in very very thin margin. So these are all some very important issues, and that's what we will be educating them. And we want to go, and fab requires many levels. We are going to go from a technician level to the manager level to design engineer level, equipment maintenance level. So many things that we can aim for. And interestingly, this is not just a training fab. This will also be a prototyping fab where we can actually do some chips. We will do some chips. So anybody who is going to graduate out of this fab would have an experience of doing a chip end to end. Right? And that's very, very important. That's why we said this is two first of its kind. And we'll work on that curriculum. We have a lot of people who, have, who will be supporting us from IIT Madras, from other IITs, and also people like Raj Manikam has joined here, but we'll, we'll have a very good consortium. And we will also find out some customers who will, who will take these chips from us. So we'll be making some chips of some nanometer and we will be developing our own recipes. And we'll also have some consumers who will consume 5,000 chips. We can do. But all these chips that are being done by the trainees will essentially see the market. Right? So this unique experience, I'm sure, will make our guys like hot cake, you know, they will be sorted after everywhere. And that's what we want to do. And we want to do it very early, as Honorable Minister said yesterday. I, I will say day before yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> See, we should, this type of development, very good question. If you have a best question, award, I will give it for you. <laughs> See, this must be technology agnostic. This will be technology agnostic. See, there are certain fundamental things that we want to do in the fab, and that will be basically thought. So, so, and also they will be exposed to PDKs, development, etc. So that, you know, they have a complete view of what goes to the customer before they come to the fab, and what happens in the fab, right? So all those interfaces also will be teaching. So this will be uh, node agnostic. But we can actually target, you know, Something like 120, 180 type of things very easily. And we will also do some stress chips. Like if you do at 180, your 28 becomes almost quite easy, except for some leakage power and other type of issues. From a design point of view, pleasant road point of view, you actually do a lot, specifically from power management point of view. If you do a 180, I think that uh, gives you much more lessons than what you get at 28 or 16. Of course, the placement and road, all those things are taken care of automatically by tools. Tools are very good now. But very importantly, one of our biggest concentration would be that we will develop our own indigenous tool flow. Right? And uh, that is all. Because we need a fab to do it. So whatever tool we develop, the CAD tools, today it costs in millions. And the startup com many startup companies could not grow in the area of semiconductors because of the non-availability of these CAD tools. So we will now form a very big consortium which will start working on indigenous CAD flow that will also be part and that will be trained and tested in this lab. So we get a very good facility where we go and test the chip which is not available anywhere and which will, this will be enabling it. Yes. Yes. No, no, scaling, scaling up in semiconductor is a difficult task. Yes, it is difficult. See, if you undergo an operation, it will pain. It does not, no second thought about it. It is difficult. Yes, of course it will be difficult. But then people have come out. So I have, uh, Madhu is here, Incore Semiconductor. This is a company that came out of our lab. First, first to come out. And uh, we have uh, Mind Grow, we have Secure, we have multiple companies that have come out. And they are doing extremely well. Imagine sitting in Chennai, in Tamil Nadu, we have given production quality chips, right? 
this is something that we have achieved with least constraint because madhu was here and when we made the shakti together nothing no resources in the sense of support and if you go to silicon valley the type of support a semiconductor startup gets there compared to nil but from there we started and we proved that in india we can do the whole thing we taped it out at chandigarh we designed it here we made pcbs in uh, you know sibar mudur we assembled it here within our indian ecosystem we were able to show so this is a strength and we didn't show it just once now we have four chips that have been done at scl and all working first time please understand it's not a spin second time or third first time first spin it has come out currently we also made a ball grid array uh, chip from our hosur facility from uh, tata's hosur facility so things are stabilizing so the uh, if, if 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 we had worked on much more constrained environment i think going down but for a fab to succeed again take my words we need very very qualified manpower and that's what we will be generating right. yeah அதான் சொல்றாருல்ல வேற எவ்வளவு ஃபேப்ஸ் கான் வீல் அட்லீஸ்ட் வீ லிவ் இல் பரவாயில்ல மன்னிச்சு விட்டுறோம் சொல்லிட்டு அவங்களுக்கு சப்போர்ட் எல்லாம் பண்றோம் நாங்க இப்போ இந்தியா சச் லார்ஜ் மார்க்கெட் அண்ட் ஐ டோன்ட் திங்க் ஜஸ்ட் ஹேவிங் ஒன் ஃபேப் இஸ் கோன் கிவ் கிவ் பி தொல்யூஷன் வி டெஃபினெட்லி நீட் மோர் ஃபேப்ஸ் மோர் சேட்ஸ் ஐ மீன் அண்ட் ஐ திங்க் ஃபார் அஸ் ஃபார் ஸ்டேட் லைக் தமிழ்நாடு ஃபார் மீ ஐ பின் டெலிங் யூ ஃபார் ஃப்ரம் டே ஒன் தட் த சீஃப் மினிஸ்டர் ஆல்சோ we are not looking at the quantum of investment and what we are manufacturing we are looking at the kind of jobs that are being created it's for us design is more important than fab basically if you look at it but i am saying from a national security point of view south must have another fab that is my only pitch if you want to put it in kerala put it put it in kerala i don't have a problem but still we will be supplying the manufacture i know that because we have the talent to do that and we have the talent pool but the best place per, a uh, state is tamil nadu and we are pitching for a fab here but having said that my basic pitch is always to get the high end jobs for my educated masses right so yes we will be as i said indispensable in talent sourcing and we'll also very soon see the first uh, large manufacturing also coming it's just inevitable tamil nadu is inevitable Huh? As I said, said, both of us said, nah, yesterday and now, or a day before and now, we, as soon as possible, we, we have already set the ball rolling. We have already spoken to the suppliers. The things have definitely started rolling. And I do see something really um, uh, quantifiable happening at least by the end of this year, before the end of this year at least. Sorry? No, he's one of the advisors. So, IP is one of the advisors. You know, he's one of the best talents that we've had. He's been, he's headed some of the global companies and he's been in Tata also. So, he's a very, very um, um, amazing talent in himself. And we're taking advice from not only through uh, Rajmane Kumar, but from several people around the world. They're giving us inputs. Madhu sir also is giving in, inputs uh, uh, right here, the first, uh, first uh, chip. And we just spoke about the chip also here. So, uh, Sir Sunamadri, the frugal... மென்டாலிட்டி ஓட்டு அவ்வளோ கம்மியாக எவ்வளோ முடியுமோ கம்மியாக செலவு பண்ணிட்டா கூட அதில் தான் இன்னும் கொஞ்சம் நிறைய கற்றுக்க முடியும் அப்படின்னு சொன்னார் இல்லையோ அதே ஐ திங்க் ஐ டோன்ட் திங்க் வி ஆர் பீங் எக்ஸ்ட்ரீம்லி ஃப்ரூகுல் பட் ஐ திங்க் த ஹண்ட்ரட் க்ரோ தட் வி ஆர் பம்பிங் இன் இன் ஈஸ்வலி இட்ஸ் நாட் இட் இட்ஸ் நாட் இட்ஸ் நாட் த லிமிட் வி டெஃபினெட்லி வில்லிங் டு ஸ்பெண்ட் மோ டு கெட் திஸ் டன் ஹியர் பிகாஸ் வி நோ த தமிழ்நாடு இஸ் த ஓன்லி ஸ்டேட் ரைட் நாம் in a which is positioned positioned in that position to actually deliver high end high quality talent uh, to the requirement of india and uh, the world nigidla pesla man but trump but now that you asked i told i, I told some, i told some the media yesterday also tamil nadu is a, is the most resilient state in india and we have seen much worse uh, i'm really really unhappy with the kind of words the choice of words that president trump has taken um, and i'm sure the prime minister of india will respond in kind uh, and i think as a state uh, as a responsible state and a responsible 
political party also we stand with the government of india and we will stand as one uh, because this is between two countries and uh, i don't want to bring in any politics in, into this yes of course we we expect a lot and we also expect them to take us into confidence into confidence during discussions on what tariffs are are being discussed what sort of discussions are held i'm hoping they will but even if it is not the case uh, i'm sure the government of india will take a very wise stand on this making sure that our farmers are primary sector is secure and also the industrial growth of india uh, especially uh, the growth of large manufacturing states like tamil nadu maharashtra are also kept in mind uh, when they discuss rfc so what is the parameters on any country sir sir semiconductor yeah parameters yeah. so we've already yeah so we've already uh, the the land acquisition is uh, progress very well and uh, as i said now we are in talks with several companies uh, smaller sats also and some of it might come yes so the uh, as i said that those talks are going on for the common facilities we are getting the specs and discussing with the uh, uh, leading um, talents in the in the ecosystem and once the advice is received and once we get to fin finalize the common facilities that will also be set up first so once we do that then the whole ecosystem can come and also and i'm just uh, hoping that we get more land in uh, kamatur and that area it's very difficult to get land you know that so i'm uh, hoping we get some good land uh, we've already identified one but there is so much of demand uh, for kamatur and, and its ecosystem because you because of the academic ecosystem there so for the for the young minds of of term of the kamatur region also it's imperative that we get some really good land also for the for industrial parks especially in the semiconductor ecosystem